My name is Amanda. I'm a vacational student at Cardinal Cushion School. As a vacational student, I work in health careers. I like it a lot. My name is Robert. The school here is very nice. A lot of people respect you. Uh, we have a nice campus. It's really big. We got a chapel up on the hill, uh, culinary arts building, bakery. We got our own bakery, and we got our own greenhouse. The Cardinal Cushing Center has a rich history. We were founded over 60 years ago by the Sisters of St. Francis of Assisi. These creative, innovative women believed that children with intellectual disabilities could be educated. And in fact, at the turn of the century, they were the first group of people in this country to believe that. We've always been a welcoming school. We have two schools. We have a school in Braintree and we have a school in Hanover, where students from the ages of 6 to 22 are taught how to be successful adults. These are students with intellectual disabilities, emotional challenges. Sometimes they have histories of, of great trauma in their life and we gently coach them to become independent, well-adjusted adults. We support them at work, in community jobs, during the day, and help them in living situations. Our communities are places where people of all abilities are accepted for who they are and have chances to excel and to shine. And through the variety of businesses that we have on campus, these aren't make-believe businesses, places where people from the community come and our students are learning customer service. They're learning cash register skills and they're learning how to produce and manufacture artwork for the Cushing Trader or they're waiting on customers at the Bass Cafe. Not only are they jobs that these students can do in the community when they graduate, but they're meaningful ways for them to contribute now. And most of our students realize how fortunate they are to have found a place, a safe haven. One young man said to me a few weeks ago, he said, is Cardinal Cushing going to close? And I said, no, we're not going to close. And why did you ask that? And he said, because if you closed, I would have nowhere to go. <laughs> and I would be homeless on the streets. So we have to be here. It goes back to the sisters, the mission that they have entrusted to us.